Here we have the new Patriot by Tentec. And what I've done, a couple things I just wanted to show. This is the uh, rig, and I, you know, I don't have a place to mount this, the actual LCD, or in this case, the OLED display. So I just kind of stuck it there for now, and uh, I do have to take it down every time I uh, put the radio away. But we'll get a place where we can mount it. And then I also just recently put the uh, General Electric speaker on there, and uh, it is working. There's some noise right now because I don't have the antenna hooked up. And I just wanted to show also. Um, I recently just set this up and plugged in the back here, as we can see. I'll turn it around. I've uh, actually got the uh, cable plugged in. Sorry about the shaky video here. I've got the uh, cable plugged in into the back here to the USB to the Arduino board. Man, focus. There we go. So that we can then plug it into our computer over here through USB and then we also can use our uh, program when in this case I'm using um, the program DX labs it's similar to HRD I just like to use it because it's free and it's got upgrades and stuff too but so for instance uh, right now I'm looking at um, let's see here this spot down here and if I click on the one below it, right now the radio is set to, uh, what's the frequency, 14290. And you can see it's set to 14290 here too. Now if I click this, which the same thing would work with DX Labs or uh, HRD, this is uh, DX Labs. But if I clicked on a spot, oh this guy here, you know, he's on 14263. You can see the change there in Commander, and you can see also that it's sending the commands here too. So it's working good with HRD or DX Labs, and um, you can log and do your own thing. Portable with a laptop in a, a little box and set up, and you're good to go. Anyway, just wanted to preview that. Any questions, uh, let me know if I can help. And I'm definitely not the expert, but there are plenty out there.